E toru ngā pīpī kā rea rea ka pakeke mai ki te puku o Rotorua me te aha he tua tahitanga tēnei momo kaupapa ki roto o Aotearoa nei. Ko te ngako o te kaupapa nei he whakarau o rāke anō i taua momo manu. A nei te pūrongo a Kerea Marait. E toru wiki noa te pakeke, a kuni ngā punua kā rea rea e toru nei ka kawea ki te puku o Rotorua ki reira pakeke mai ai. This is so exciting. It's the first ever urban release of a threatened species in New Zealand, not least of kāriaria. Uh, so we're really excited about the opportunity. I think that they're not just New Zealand's fastest bird, they're New Zealand's fastest growing yeah. bird as well. E rua ngā tamakotahi te kōtiro i whānau mai ki Wingspan nei. Engari nā te mahi ngā tahi a Wingspan me te whare taonga o te arawa, ka ko kē rātau ki te rere i te taoni. We wanted to engage community, we wanted to highlight a conservation program about how special these birds are and uh, it's a, a method of release that has been trialled around the world. Mō ngā wiki e rua e hārea ke nei karakai nā ngā punua manu e toru ki roto i tēnei kohanga. Ka whangaia ke kotahi te wā i a rā, ka tahi ka tukuna ki te ao, kia rere. Once they're released from the box, each one, each falcon chick will have a little backpack um, transmitter. And so a little bit like you know, on the radio, if you like. So we'll be able to track them from uh, dawn till dusk. E ai ki ngā tatauranga tōna whā mano noe ho ngā takirua kā rea rea e ora tonu ana. Nā reira ka tokoa ke te uru paunamu e pēhea te mō rea rea tanga o te noho ki te taoni. Essentially there's no more risks for these young birds then exists already for kariaria and kariaria have been in, in the area for thousands of years. The majority of them have injuries caused by deliberate shooting, so it's about highlighting a conservation um, effort. Ko te wero tuatahi ki a rātau, hea ko ki te rere. Kere am a right, te karere.